We have a 1981 380SEL here on the hoist, and the customer came in because he was complaining about a heavy vibration at high speeds. And the reason why, even at, he also said it happens sometimes at low speeds, and the reason why is because the front tire is out of round. And when we set, talk about out of round, there's actually a lump in this on the tire in this area. This tire has a huge lump in it. So when, you, when he was driving the car, he would feel the car vibrating. The steering wheel would vibrate a lot. And um, we looked closely at the front tires and we saw that this tire was out of round in this area. So when we rotated the tire, you could actually see a lump in the tire. And this is the reason why the tire was causing this vibration in the steering wheel. We recommended that we change these tires because these tires actually, actually have a date stamp on it of 2 of 85 and this, is, this manufacturing date indicates that these tires were made in 1995 so he needs to replace these tires. These tires are um, well over 15 years old so these tires should be replaced amazing. You can see from the bottom view of the tire, looking up, that the tire has a lump in it. The other thing we've noticed on the car, and the other, that he should do on the car, is that the steering shock is worn out. And we've tested the steering shock. This is the steering shock right here. We disconnected it, and we checked the resistance on it. There's actually no resistance on the steering shock. I'm doing it with one hand. Normally, it takes two hands to do this. And this steering shock or steering dampener um, has too much play in it. Should have some some resistance, and it's and there's absolutely no play. So we're recommending that he change all four of his tires because they're all the same age, and they all are worn out on the inside tread. The yellow chalk indicates where the tread's worn out.